Hey, welcome back to Gomes Tech Talks channel. We are in part two video of upgrading to the latest version of Business Central. What you need to know. And if you have missed the previous uh, video, part one video, please go and check in the description. I have given the link, and also you can find it in Gomes Tech Talks channel. Before we proceed, I'd like to tell you that this is my channel, Gomes Tech Talks, where you can find various information, various important videos on Business Central power pages of at most all the Microsoft related technologies and also other skills. Okay, so you consider subscribing to my channel if you haven't subscribed yet. So please subscribe in order to get the latest videos. And also you can join as a member here to to get exclusive access to the perks like a book a PDF of a book and you can directly mail me and directly um, contact me for your uh, support on any of your code help or any other project help, whatever I know, I will definitely share with you okay and why that is the reason behind joining as a member is what this is the these are the member only videos okay so i'll be adding more videos into it which are very exclusive and you can see that if you click on this video you can find the complete set of videos on business central functional and technical consultants like what is the process what are the interview questions you can face you will be facing it scenario based questions direct questions uh, business central uh, technical consultant interview questions what are the templates and what are the checklist what where the uh, functional consultant who should have and i'll be adding the list further like i'll be adding more and more videos into it so consider joining the as a member okay so let me go back to the topic so in the previous video we have covered we have covered till uh, data migration okay so this is very very important okay the upgrade let's start like what is upgrading okay you have to stay update up to date and you should see microsoft release often microsoft will also release the versions often okay so you have to be very competitive and more secure in order to do that we need the upgrade okay we have already discussed till data migration okay we have completed till data migration and we are at to uh, discuss about user training rollback and everything so i'll be discussing about like who will be responsible for this like whether it is a technical consultant or a business and uh, business central functional consultant and also what is the criticality level of this and how you can do this what are the reference materials you can see that okay so that is what we're going to discuss so yes uh, as i told uh, we have to start with the user training okay so user training is a critical aspect of a successful upgrade. So user training ensures that your team can effectively use the new features and interface. Microsoft provides various resources for user training, including documentation and video tutorials. OK, you can click here to see. And if you want this um, a mind map so you can check that in my description okay so user training so here you can see the complete documentation of uh, business central here where you can learn everything in one go okay so this is what uh, you have we have to train the users on the new changes only then they can use it and also you can refer to the business central and the security severity level is the medium okay you can train it and the responsibility is for functional consultants how they have to use the um, bc business central so this is a success tip for functional consultant that provide hands-on training and documentation for the uh, trainees okay users and you may face this challenge that is user resistance to the change okay if you will not get used to the used to the new changes but of course microsoft is giving more and more user-friendly interface so it will be easy for them to utilize it okay so then next comes the rollback plan so a rollback plan is a uh, your safety net in case something goes wrong during the upgrade it allows you to revert to the previous version of the data okay so who will be responsible for this your technical consultant okay he should be able to go back or take you back to the previous version so regularly update and test uh, and plan to ensure its effectiveness so this is what even microsoft has given the rollback uh, plan as well you can check if you couldn't find it please let me know i can definitely help you out okay 
and the responsibility is what the technical consultant technical consultant has to take care of it and the severity level is critical and this is the success tips which i wanted to give it for every technical consultant that regularly update and test and roll back plan okay like and test the roll back plan whether you can definitely do it whether you can uh, successfully do it and challenges is uh, challenges are identifying the point of failure during the roll back plan okay and uh, this is what the next which is up this once you have upgraded okay uh, once the upgrade is completely done which means that it is not completed okay you have to go with the post upgrade support so post upgrade support is a crucial to address any issues that may arise after after you have upgraded after you have done everything so post upgrade support is very crucial so you should be prepared to offer support and address issues after, uh, issues during post upgrade and this is ongoing support like you have to monitor and you have to give support often and the severity level is really high and responsibility are like you have to uh, like both the technical and functional consultant so wherever you see joint effort it is both technical and functional consultant okay technical and functional okay and this is the success tip i wanted to give it like monitor system performance often collect user user feedback and also provide timely support to them and these are the challenges like resolving unexpected post upgrade issues like and you, you you will not be expecting this this will happen but definitely you will get it sometime so you should always do that so you can you have to always keep in touch okay so how to upgrade it and next comes the documentation so talking about the documentation is your key to successful upgrades and ongoing maintenance functional consultant are responsible for the documenting uh, the entire upgrade process this includes configuration customization testing results and any issues encountered so a comprehensive documentation is essential for future reference and also for the compli compliance uh, sorry compliance audits okay which is very very essential for that so the success tips which i want to give it for the uh, functional consultant is what maintain detailed record for future reference and audit so if you want to do if you need a documentation if you need a template for the documentation please let me know i will prepare and give it for you if you uh, and also the challenges which you may face is what ensuring thorough documentation okay this will be literally crucial okay so let us go to the next one which is continuous monitoring okay continuous monitoring after upgrade continuous monitoring is necessary to ensure everything runs smoothly this phase involves both technical and functional consultants and also establish monitoring routines to identify and address performance issue be proactive in addressing any bottleneck and or any unexpected behavior in that so the severity level is medium because almost we have done upgrading everything and it is going smoothly but you need to monitor monitor it continuously and uh, and the joint responsibility um, responsibility will be the joint okay so like both the technical and functional consultant to should take care of this and you can see that um, the success tip which i wanted to give it for both the technical and functional consultant is what establish monitoring routines and address issues promptly okay and also the challenges which you may face is what identifying and resolving the bottle bottlenecks so here you can see monitoring and analyzing telemetry documentation which is given to us by microsoft itself you can make use of it okay and next comes the compliance and regulations compliance with the industry specific regulation is paramount so functional consultant should lead compliance check and ensure that your upgraded system meets all regularity requirements stay up to date uh, with changing reg regulations that may impact your business okay and you can see that uh, the severity level is high and the success tip for the consultant which i wanted to give is what uh, consult with legal expert if needed and perform compliance audit and keeping up with changing regulations and finally we should talk about communication okay and uh, you have clear and proactive communication is very very essential throughout the upgrade process and uh, 
the thing is like functional consultants play a crucial role in um, managing users expectation inform all stakeholders about the upgrade plan and its potential impacts encourage open communication channels for user feedback address concerns promptly to minimize disruptions so these are very very important and crucial part and this is actually the severity level is medium but you have to communicate it properly so that is very very important and this is the success tip which i wanted to give it to the functional consultants what clear and proactive communication to minimize disruption and challenges you may face is what managing user expectation and concerns so yes we have come to an end that we have completely discussed the uh, comprehensive guide to upgrade microsoft dynamics 365 business central in two parts we have covered everything from why and how to crucial steps responsibilities and potential changes remember upgrading is essential for keeping your business competitive and secure if you found this video useful don't forget to like subscribe and share stay tuned for more valuable content consider joining as a member and if you really like this video give us super thanks so thanks for watching and stay tuned to see the next exciting video thank you take care and bye bye